All right, let's go. Uh, let's go see what Leon's got to say. Took him forever to get here. What the hell was he doing? I'm pretty sure this is the way you have to go. What is this? Some kind of a waiting room? This place is set up so strangely. So strangely. It turns a museum into a police station. That's what I'm saying. Ah, oh, shit. I'm gonna need to get into this later. Fuck. <laughs> I'll be back. I'll be back. Okay. Hey! Claire? Leon! I'll be right there! Come on. Leon! We really gotta stop meeting like this. Are you all right? Police chopper, it just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. No, I don't. It's good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah. Did you find your brother? I did, actually. He's... <laughs> just when you think it can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to safety. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please, just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. <laughs> uh, the, uh... Marvin, this is bad. I've got zombies everywhere. Marvin? Marvin, are you there? Marvin? God, you gotta be kidding me. The version of this uh, walkthrough that I had done before. Oh, he'll be fine. I had done uh, Leon A, Claire B, while playing through this the first time, and the version of that conversation is so stupid when it comes to when Leon is on this side of the fence, talking to... Oh, is he still alive? Okay. I gotta hurry. What it... Ha uh, they have their conversation there and Claire's on the other side of the fence and the zombies the explosion happens and the zombies start coming and and instead of anybody acting with any kind of urgency it's just sort of like yeah yeah how are you doing I was like well you should go like yeah well uh, let's keep having a conversation that kind of shit it's so stupid I could have used that green herb earlier Whatever. I gotta go back and now that fucking zombie on fire is in the way. You think eventually it would burn up, but it's always gonna be there. Man. Weapons locker key card. Definitely gonna want that. I could have done that later, but 
As long as I have space in the inventory, there's no sense in not doing it now. Oh no! Still took a lot of ammo bringing that fucker down. You think a guy on fire would have been a little bit more fragile? I was here, wasn't I? I'm gonna be going through this room a bit. Can't take it. See, only two shots this time. Alright, I'm gonna just have to take note of where some of this shit is. Cause I'm gonna have to I'm gonna be coming back. Tell me I can't go through this way? Where did you come from? What? Fuck. Should have used a knife. Some stuff in here I'm gonna have to get. Gunpowder. Got that crank. I do have myself turned around a little bit. More gunpowder. I gotta go back like an idiot. Unbelievable. So much backtracking. <laughs> now, that's always been a Resident Evil thing. Backtracking and backtracking and backtracking, and you have to do all the backtracking in the world. Especially if you don't remember the optimum way of getting through the game. So this is the second time I've gone and done backtracking because I found more items that I thought like, oh well, I, I should uh, I should try to keep this. Well, you know. See, here we are. I gotta get that shit, but I kind of want to hold on to this because I'm gonna be making the pass along over near that soon. Don't think I'm gonna need that. Alright, that ought to be enough. Put half my fucking inventory in there. That was something that they did in the original Resident Evil 2, was to have when your character is injured, have them move a little bit slower and a little bit, uh, like, like they're injured. Remember, it could be quite a hassle if you, uh, if you didn't, if you're trying to get away from zombies and you're moving just that much slower because you're hurt, it's a pain in the ass, but... He's not getting through. We're fine. Okay, we got the crank. 
Oh, fuck. The fuse was here, too. Not that I could get it anyway, because I didn't have any fucking space. Will they follow me into this room here? I think they won't. I know Mr. X will, but I don't think they will. Man. Come on. You know, maybe they will. If they will, I'd actually be pretty convenient. If they follow me in the here, there's always a uh, big wide area that they'll that they'll get lost in, and I can always go around them. In this narrow ass hallway, though. Come on. They're gonna I'm gonna have to go around them, squeeze around them. Wow. Creepy as shit, isn't it? When you get the submachine gun, that is actually a really useful weapon because it has the same chance Son of a bitch. to dismember as the uh, as the pistol does. But it doesn't. Uh, but you have so much ammo that I could just stand there and just fire a few quick shots off under their leg, or their arms, or whatever, and dismember them. I guess they're not going to follow me in there. What didn't I get in here? There we go. That was that was probably it. Nope, green herb. Fuck, I'll have to come back for it. <laughs> Still don't have enough space. Alright, what don't I need and what can I get? Uh, there we go. Let's go get that fucking... Get that, uh... Weapons locker thing. No longer need that key. Fortunately, we're actually really close to the weapons locker. What? You both really have to be here? Okay, now we gotta take a quick... Oh shit, are you kidding me? I forgot the stuff. Alright, I got what I needed. Now we can get this just straight away. Fantastic. Useful for killing the more dangerous enemies. We also have... We also have the extra key, so you gotta take into account what it is you can actually get out of here. Now, we're eventually gonna get both... Eventually gonna get both keys, as long as I don't fuck it up. So we'll be able to get everything. But, like... 208 will get me into there. 203 will get me in here, meaning I can't get it yet, because both 2 and 3 are missing and I only have one key. 102, 103. So if I use 102, if I put it in number 2, I can get gunpowder. If I put it in number 3, I can get a knife. But 
But if I put it, okay, if I put it in a two, I get more stuff. Hey, Claire, I got news for you. You can pull those keys off and put them wherever you need to. That sounds like a good idea, right? And you know what? You can actually press it without the key being there. Yeah, I know. Mind-blowing. You don't have to... play a weird puzzle of what you're going to get and what you're going to leave behind. Okay, what do I got to do now? At least would finish on that gun, the uh, grenade launcher. Okay, we have that handle now. So we can... We can do this. those steam steam pipes here for some fucking reason. Does this guy look alright? Yeah, he's fine. Gotta love that grenade launcher. Oh shit! You bet. Yeah, it's pretty good. The star's office is actually a safe room, which I'm definitely needing because Claire's almost dead. Who kept their damn guitar here? Uh. Hmm. No space. Fantastic. Yeah, she looks like she's in good shape. One 9-volt battery that will fit in any fucking pocket you would have. Can't carry it. Okay. Okay, we're back here. Marvin, how you doing? Yeah, he's still alive. There you go. 